Its mother will hit them with two quick goals. The first came in eight minutes. John Philibin's free kick headed across goal by Steve Kirk, and David Weir sliced the ball into his own net. Three minutes later, it was 2-0. Paul McGrillan outstripping the Falkirk defence, coolly rounding Tony Parks and slotting the ball home. Motherwell looking odds-on for only their third away victory of the season. Falkirk's best first-half chance came when Kevin McAllister went down when challenged by Phil O'Donnell. It earned a free kick on the edge of the box. McAllister knocked the ball to Tommy McQueen, who was just off target with his left foot drive. McQueen came close early in the second half, spotting the top corner vacant when the ball broke to him on the edge of the box. But Dykstra got across for what in the end was an easy save. With the wind at their backs, Falkert drove forward. McQueen's free kick held up by Cadet and slid into the path of Craig Taggart, but the youngster couldn't beat Dykstra. There hadn't been much activity around Tony Park's goal in the second half, but he contrived to make life difficult for himself in 79 minutes, handling what the referee interpreted as a passback, giving Motherwell an indirect free kick. Falkirk masked the barricades to first foil Steve Kirk and then David Cooper. Joe McLaughlin completing the clearance. Falkirk deserved a goal for their second half efforts and they got it in 83 minutes. Substitute Ian McCall stepped up to take a corner from the right and it took route one to goal. McCall's strike gave Falkirk fans hopes of a point, but not for long. Mother was clincher with a minute to go, and a top-class effort at that. The move was started and finished by substitute Jamie Dolan, first feeding Phil O'Donnell to go on a run, and then following up to support him, take the return pass and dispatch the ball behind Tony Parks. 